Welcome back to LP's LP's Let's Play Mother 2 Earthbound. Last episode, we got access to Saturn Valley. Yeah, chock full of Mr. Saturns. Adorable and slightly horrific. Uh, they helped us get behind the waterfall, which led us down here. And I think there's the big bad here. But first, we're going to have to get past this little bad. Aren't you the fly, honey delivery boy? What's the password? Doesn't mean I don't trust you. Just say it. Say it now. Someone so quiet as the other, extremely shy or extremely dangerous. What a suspicious fellow. Well, what if we're both suspicious, or rather, excuse me, both dangerous and shy? No, that's a possibility. And we fought these slimy little pies last episode, at the tail end particularly. <laughs> and it started out with just like a couple, but they kept calling more. And we'd kill one, and then more would show up, and we'd kill one, and before we killed it, it summoned more. It was horrifying, but thankfully we have dealt with this one, even though he did do a whopping amount of damage there at the end. Did we get anything good? No, we did not. That's fine, because I think we're getting close to where we should be. It looks like, I mean, this is the end of the road. We got to go north into there, so before we do, I'm going to see if we can actually heal up any. Um, hmm. It'd be nice... If, uh, if Pongo could do from some freaking life up herself, because LP does not have the PP required to do it. So we've got three healing items. All three are pretty strong. The hand aid, the croissant, and the protein drink. Uh, Farku probably needs it the least, so we'll give the protein drink to LP. He's the leader after all he needs to get his muscle fuel. And now he's good to go. Pongo is probably next in line with being roughly half dead already. And we can let her eat the croissants. As I understand it, the hand aid is a full heal. And we don't want to uh don't want to waste that. I guess waste is probably not the right word. We don't want to use that on only 43 recovery. No! We got assaulted! We're trying to leave! You gross little piles. Ugh. Alright, well, shoot one, Pongo, use fire on the others, and Farku, shoot the other. Hopefully this is enough to kill them in the one turn and they don't summon any more little demons. Goodness gracious, we just healed. We just healed. Uh, <laughs> I'm gonna throw up. Are you kidding me? All right, Bongo, you're gonna have to use it again. I wanted to, I wanted to be, you know, better off for the obviously approaching boss fight, but it would seem that's not possible. These guys have a lot of health. They really, I, every time we face them, I think, okay, whatever, they're fine. We're just going to do it and get on with it. And I guess I get confused by how often they just don't hit us, right? Like they exhale a lot of this nastiness uh, and, and stinkiness fairly often, which does affect us, but it doesn't always, as you see right there, because we're already crying. But they do that many, many times, and I forget that they're actually capable of doing like 50 damage. And, and receiving plenty of damage as well. Okay, let's just, let's get rid of them this turn. No, we missed two out of the three attacks. It's great. They're going to continue their stinking. Uh, you know what? Let's just run away. Let's just run away. Ah. <laughs> the stink was too strong. It's too smelly. There's no escaping the stink. We're leaving. Whether you like it or not, we're leaving. We're getting out of here. We're getting out of here. It's going to happen one way or another. The same freaking thing happened again. My god, I just skipped forward because it's annoying as all get out facing like 27 freaking slime balls in a row. And what's even worse is that they hurt us. Mainly LP. Uh, he was fully restored essentially. And look at this. Yeah, clearly. The big boss, the big disgusting heap of garbage that that thing is. I guess we have to use the hand aid now. All right, uh, hand aid, use it, slap it on LP's forehead. LP maxed out. Uh, we don't have any PSI really. I mean, Pongo has some. LP can do nothing at all. But so be it. Let's let's attack this monstrosity. So you are LP. You see, York, there's a prophecy that a boy will destroy Master Gigas. Yee <laughs> you make me laugh so hard. If Master Gigas is scared of someone, 
He would have to be worse than the greatest evil. I'll take you down big time, so get ready for the worst fight of your life. Get ready to feel the pain of True Naja. <laughs> Come on, let's go. The pain of True Naja, he says. Well, I've experienced this pain, my man. I have vomited a time or two. That's unpleasant, but we do have a thing that I know you... No, 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 I don't want to use that. <laughs> I don't want to use the ATM card on him. We're going to bribe him. Uh, the Jar of Fly Honey, his favorite uh, scent, I guess. I don't know if it's a scent or a delicacy or what he does with it. Everyone else, we're going to assault him. Farku, use the bomb. Or use the bottle rocket, actually, even better. Yeah, Master Belch, Pongo, use the fire. The fire versus the Master Belch did 110. Jar of Honey, Master Belch grabbed it. Oh my god. It didn't work. It didn't work. The bottle rocket. We just wasted a bottle rocket on this thing. That's terrible. And he burped on us. Isn't it lovely? All right. Well, shoot him with the slingshot. Pongo, again, use your fire attack. And then Farku, I guess, just shoot him normally. That's really disappointing that we just wasted a bottle rocket. LP felt sick and took 20 damage. Goodness gracious. Master Belch lost his mind while wolfing down the fly honey. I've been in that same situation, man. Not with, not with fly honey, <laughs> uh, but but with, with, with green chili, actually. Yeah, some Colorado green chili. Delicious. LP, you're going to have to start hitting this boy, uh, especially if you're dying like this. Because we don't really have any means to heal you. Pray. What is pray? I haven't used that yet. Let's see what it does. Pongo prayed with her whole heart. A warm light surrounded LP and his friends. And recovered our H. Ooh, it was a, a group heal. Okay, well, that's worth investigating further. And that's like, she can just keep doing that. A very subtle light. <laughs> that's awesome. That's awesome. Because that's not using pee pee or anything. She can just pray the whole time. And uh, just bow your head, Pongo, and fill us with light that heals. Fantastic, fantastic. Between that and Belch just suckling on the fly, honey, however long that takes, uh, this should go well. So what what exactly is LP's problem here? He's he's nausea, not nauseated. That's why he can't. That's why he can't hit him. How does he? How does he become un unnauseated? Denausified? How is that a, a thing? We don't. Maybe healing would do it, but we don't. We were missing. We're short of one freaking PB. Uh, continue to try and power through, dude. I know that you're hungover, but you really gotta come through with us. This is terrible. This really, I mean, if, if LP wasn't sick, this would help a lot. What if LP used a bomb? You can continue to pray. Farku can continue to shoot. Oh, LP recovered 136. That was good. Needed that. Threw the bomb, did 63, which is good. Oh my god! Farku just attacked LP. Are you kidding me? You swine, I was just... You know, I was getting all excited there about how we did the good, but now you're... Mm. We've got to be close, alright? We've done a lot of damage, I feel like, to this pile of vomit. Farku attacked himself, clearly. <laughs> Farku attacks, Farku dodges. Alright, well, the bombs worked. LP can attack with those, but he can't attack with his... Freaking slingshot. A uh, little worried about Farku killing us. Uh, golly gee, Williger, dude. He almost killed Pongo. Oh no, now we're falling asleep. This is going to be the death of it because LP just takes 20 damage for every turn that we're asleep. Okay, thankfully LP woke up, but he's still sick. We need Pongo to wake up. Ugh. Do we have any goods we can use? We don't. Oh my god, what is going on here? This, I, this fight was probably not supposed to be this difficult, right? If we didn't have this exact combination of ailments, we'd probably be in okay shape. Let's just, uh, please let me use it. <laughs> we don't have any goods worth using either. Oh, Cheechamongus, shoot the belch. Uh, Farku, please shoot the belch. Oh boy. Oh please. No, 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 you rodent! Why would you do this? <laughs> oh my god, Farku. Alright, Pongo, you continue to pray. You can continue to defend. 
up. Oh, LP has died. LP has died. It's it's just us. It's just it's just Pongo and Farku. Oh my God! All right, Pongo, pray. Farku, please kill the enemy. Please kill the enemy. Please kill the enemy. Oh, you attacked yourself. You have a weapon. It's like, I don't know. Where do I point this thing? Are we going to point it at the giant blob that's right in front of us? Oh, nope. It's my face. Oh, Farku. Goodness gracious. Great balls of fire. Farku attacks, and he narrowly missed whatever his target was. Great. I mean, potentially great, right? If he was aiming at one of us. I have to think he's got to be aiming at him. Gosh, darn it, dude. You're going to kill yourself on the battlefield. <laughs> this is terrible. He killed Pongo. He killed Pongo. Great. Well done, Farku. You, oh, my God. This is terrible. Pongo. Oh, no. Pongo's alive. Pongo bash belch. Just forget it. And you defend. We're just going to we're gonna rely on Pongo. Pongo's going to do her, like, two damage that she can do per turn, and Farku's going to defend forever. How do you miss this thing? How do you miss this thing so many times? It's like a giant teal blob. It's occupying the entirety of the room, and certainly it's not moving. At least if it is moving, it's not moving very quickly. I mean, come on! It's got no limbs, for goodness sake! Oh my god, finally! Like 40 freaking turns later. Pongo and Farku got all of the XP for that, bringing Pongo to 21. Uh, we even used the uh, the Guts capsule on Pongo there. <laughs> uh, but she realized the power of offense up a hey, Farku leveled up to 23, getting nothing necessarily too exciting. But man, the excitement is just getting beyond that. Looks like it was an even fight. <laughs> but Master Gigas has managed to get the Mani Mani statue in the foresight. The city will soon be in worse condition than living in your own puke. <gasps> Suffers, Spanky. <laughs> yeah! Great, great. All right, now this lady here is the leader. Pongo, all right, let's, let's go and heal, please. Like, we cannot come into contact with anyone else, except for Mr. Saturn. I escaped! Zoom! We're dying! Goody! Bird! Please heal me. <laughs> Please, can we rub your beautiful bulbous nose on my spirit? Maybe that'll heal me. I guess not. Um, maybe you! You are down! Dying bird! I think it's you! I am worn down. Can you help me? With that? No, you can't do anything. Okay, I have dollars. I could make it rain. Mr. Saturn, oh my god, what is this? We're in the the village now. Go in hot spring. Wash barf off your body. Okay, let's do that. Longer ladder can go to hot springs. I see that. Well, it didn't heal us, but that was nice. Hot springs, rest here. Do we have to do something? Are we supposed to like get healed in here? Yeah, it would make sense, but I guess that's not the not the case. Wait, a cup of coffee here. A cup of coffee has no problem. Drink coffee before go. Say yes to me. Say no to me. Say yes. Bottoms up. Doing. We drank the coffee and became inebriated. Apparently, it seems Mr. Saturn has been putting some things in there. You've traveled very far from home. Dot dot dot. We're going to let the text get a little bit higher so I can read. Because I feel like reading at that pace is just a little bit too slow for my taste personally. Once we get near the top here, it'll be fine. Do you remember how long, how your long and winding journey began with someone pounding at your door? It was Pokey, the worst person in your neighborhood who knocked on the door that fateful night. On your way, you have walked, thought, and fought. Yet through all of this, you have never lost your courage. You have grown steadily stronger, though you have experienced the pain of battle many times. These are all true facts. A voice speaking through my inebriation. <laughs> I'm tripping out, man. Look at all the visuals. You are no longer alone in your adventure. Pongo, who is steadfast, kind, and even pretty, is always at your side. Farku is with you as well. 
Though he is timid, he came from a distant land to help you. LP, as you certainly know by now, you are not a regular young man. You have an awesome destiny to fulfill. Is this, is this the Mr. Saturn talking to us? Are we having a nice chat over coffee? He drugged us and is speaking to our uh, passed out body sitting there in the stump. The journey from this point will be long and it will be more difficult than anything you have undergone to this point. Yet, I know you will be all right. When good battles evil, which side do you believe wins? Do you have faith that good is triumphant? I do, actually. I, I tend to believe in that. I mean, why else would we... Why else would we set out to do things if we didn't believe that we could overcome the negativity? One thing you must never lose is courage. If you believe in the goal you are striving for, you will be courageous. There are many difficult times ahead, but you must keep your sense of humor, work through the tough situations, and enjoy yourself. Well, that shouldn't be a problem. This game is rather humorous, and it's definitely enjoyable, so... Thanks for that. <laughs> and then if I come across any problems, I can just consult the Oracle, aka Google, or I can also buy a hint, which actually is probably the better idea. When you have finished this cup of coffee, your adventure will begin again. Next, you must pass through a vast desert and proceed to the big city of Foreside. Interesting. Okay. It's nice that we, we sat here and did this so that now we know we need to go to a desert. So that's, that's something to keep in mind going forward. LP, Pongo, Farku, I wish you luck. Thanks, Mr. Saturn. I appreciate it. <laughs> can I can I go heal now? Because LP is like dead. We're just having this cup of coffee, Pongo and Farku, with LP's carcass just strewn over a log. No rush, no rush or anything, of course. Perfect. Now that that is complete, let's descend and talk to a couple more Saturns. Appreciate, I so happy, happy zone. Oh, so great, great. I'm glad to have pleased you all. We still can't go up there. I mean, maybe we can. Maybe we can talk to them now. So let's try that out. Appreciate. Well, you. Appreciate incorrectly because you're inhibiting my progress. I want to talk to the duck. Gosh darn it, I want to speak to the duck. Maybe the duck could heal me. More importantly, though, I think it was in this house that has the uh, the healy one. Are you the healer? I would love to slumber. Can I slumber my way? Working through the night, Farku fixed the broken iron. After being fixed, the broken iron became the slime generator. Oh my, LP is still dead. <laughs> no problem at all, of course. What is the slime generator? I guess that's probably in Farku's inventory. The slime generator. Items for Farku. Sprays a sticky substance that stops the enemy from moving. Can be used many times. Okay, well that, that, that'll surely come in handy. I guess it's something of a paralysis. There's gotta be a Dr. Saturn here somewhere, right? Like... This one? He's the doctor. Yeah, yeah, repair me. I would... Please, yes. Oh, thank God. <laughs> we're alive! Oh, we're alive! Maybe now we can talk to these guys and they can... No? I, mean, I had something new to say, but it didn't help. Oh! <laughs> Breathe is so good! Indeed it is. Breathing is a necessary component to, uh, to well, to my existence. I think new things, different things from now. Maybe we gotta, maybe these guys on the interior, maybe they have the... Here is present, I hand you a cup of life noodles. I hand you Mr. Saturn coin. I no hand you my stag wheel. Oh, tease you, I have no something. Yes, Mr. Saturn has nothing. Oh, yep, that's the that's the one that told me how to, uh, to get behind the waterfall. No, seared. And this one, what did you have to say? Oh, don't you? Oh, that's the one that wants to, to sell me the things that I can buy at the store already. That's fine. That's fine, my man. I have no news. No, 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 no use for those. At least not right now. This is the shop. Hmm. Okay, so how do we get to the desert? <laughs> Where do we go for that? I, I want to go up here, but this is not... No, it just says appreciate. You're, you're welcome, friend. Yes, you very much are. Was there a way to go up and around over here? Yes, there is this cavern. 
Whole milky well. What this? Ding, ding. Uh, yes, okay. <laughs> Don't know what that means, but we're going inside and we're attacked by things that I have never seen before. Ran boob. Ran boob. Okay, ran boob. We're all going to attack the one on the left initially just to see what what it's got going on. It's pretty strong. Goodness gracious. And that knows shield even better. And then, yeah, just attack it all. Just Goodness gracious, Farku's gonna die in the first freaking battle. <laughs> what the heck, man? We're gonna have to go freaking heal immediately after and then assuredly these guys are gonna be back. But I'd rather not do that. So hopefully using like a life up will be enough to, uh, to, to, to let us progress a little bit further. Pongo leveled up to 22, excellent. Nothing exciting, but Farku got 24 and got three to offense, which is pretty darn exciting. And then three to IQ as well and 10 HP. Delightful. Um, yep, there's some more demons. Let's use the life up on Farku. Beautiful. Okay, now you guys come get chickamonga-sized. You're definitely going to be using a strutting evil mushroom. I thought it was going to be a normal mushroom. And that's a tough mobile sprout. It's white. It's devoid of all pigmentation. It hasn't been spending nearly enough time in the sun. Let us... Uh, yeah, let's just use regular eggs and reg... Nah, let's use the strong strong fire. And then Farku, shoot the Ranboo. The mushroom attack did 16 damage, not bad. The second one scattered some pores and... Oh my god, it, it freaking mushroomed me, didn't it? No! <laughs> no, I'm not ready to mess with my control. I'm gonna have, definitely going to have to go back to the doctor now. Hopefully, that doctor can, can do something. Oh, bungus. Cool, only the one mushroom left. Just eat it, just kill it, just eat it. Hurry up. He's feeling funky. Farku got mushroomized, not LP. Okay, maybe that means that we won't... That we won't, uh... Have our movement messed up. Pongo nearly freaking died. LP leveled up, got a number of good things. Oh, God, yep. Look at that. Mr. Jeff, Mr. Farku got himself a hat. <laughs> uh, life up, super life on Pongo. Max that baby out. Excellent. And we'll move on. Because I don't think the mushroom has any other negative effect other than messing with and, like, impairing your your movement. Is this... No, there's stuff beyond. I was going to say, is this just a clearing? Is this really all that there was? No, it continues on. More eggs. Please and thank you. And more fire. Just so we can hopefully dispose of them as quickly as possible. So I'd really rather not uh, get spored. That didn't kill it. That's amazing. That was 150 damage. So the, the these things are, are pretty strong. Maybe we're going to have to level at least a little bit. I guess we'll see. That killed it. Thank God. That, that should kill everything. Yeah, they all dead. Perfect. We used a lot of PP on it, but whatever. It's necessary. Necessary? Is it necessary to drink my own urine? <laughs> Uh, more ran boobs. Goodness gracious. All right, buddies. Come on. We got the we got the stick on you there. I don't know how you didn't see me coming. But here's a chance for a surprise opening attack. Everyone, go after them. Pongo, you can use Psy Power. Perfect. Oh, my God. LP, you of all people missing. How dare you? How dare you? And then hopefully we can kill them. Ah, the shield. The shield's not going to be, well, helpful to our cause. Got the second one and the first one perfect. And we're going to have to use life up again because Mr. Mushroom Boy is dying. Great. Pongo leveled up. Got five to her PP, which is great. Okay. Life up A on Farku. And can we heal him? Like, does this work on Farku? No. You can't heal the spores. The spores are eternal. The spores are a problem that can only be solved by a specific man inside of a hospital who 
I guess, eats them? I really don't know. <laughs> I don't know what he does with them. I mean, I would probably eat it. I mean, it's a big old much. Goodness, Pongo's been spored. Oh, buddy, we're all gonna be diseased here sooner rather than later because we have encountered a mushroom at every turn. The plant tried to take PP from the one member of the party that didn't have any. It's a bold, a bold choice, Cotton. Truly. Got rid of all of them? Thank God. Thank God. All right. Burning through our Psy Power really, really quickly. Hopefully we come across some sort of healing. But it looks like, nope, more just, just more ran boobs. Isn't it? How lovely. At least, you know, this is giving us the opportunity to, to level, right? Like, we gotta look at the bright side. You sure we're getting assaulted by a wealth of heinous beasts? But what doesn't kill you makes you stronger. Or something like that, I don't know, because this very well might kill us too. Farku leveled up, excellent. We're definitely seeing some, some level of rewards. All right, life up again, because Farku, Farku is far, pretty much dead. Nah, he's better now, okay. Now you, and then we'll get to go in another cavern. Great. There's probably even more heinous enemies there. Amazing, isn't it? Lovely. Oh boy, LP shoot it. Pongo pray and Farku shoot. That way we can hopefully uh, do some healing action. Oh, we're recovering PP. What is this? I don't want to recover PP. We gotta recover HP. Goodness gracious. Uh, Farku just hit himself, didn't he? <laughs> ah, defend Farku, defend Farku, goodness gracious. Oh, you're lowering the defense for everyone. Thank you, Pongo. Goodness gracious, this is terrible. And LP cannot connect a hit. This is... I'm having a tough time, y'all. I'm having a tough time. I don't know if you can tell, but I'm having a tough go of things. <laughs> Oh, that didn't kill it either. That was 100 HP. Or 77, which is close enough to 100. Still. Still. It's got a shield now. Great. Great. Oh my god. Pongo just made us cry. You gotta be kidding me. <laughs> just use fire. Put us out of our misery. Just get rid of it, please. Oh boy, so it would seem that Pongo praying has like a random effect. I thought it just gave us HP every time. I was wrong. I was so, so wrong. Let's look at the status. Uh, we're missing about 70 HP from LP, about 30 for Pongo, and about 45 for FarQ. Two of them are mushroomized. All right, LP, let's use life up on yourself, and then life up on... Farku. Perfect. Alrighty, and then into this cavern. Likely filled with death. What the heck are those? Oh, those are plants. Ha! I thought they were insects that were gonna come after us. We got a present, a coin of slumber. What is that? We also have Mr. Saturn coin. I haven't I haven't looked at that. A cup of life noodles. Revives a friend who's unconscious. In addition, it also works well on on pretty much everything, it would seem. Wild. Okay. And then the Mr. Saturn coin. Must be equipped as other. It increases your defense and luck. It's not money even though it's called a coin. Oh my. Well that I should have I should have equipped earlier. So what what good would that be if I use the coin? It would take my defense up significantly. Wow, yeah, please do, by all means. And then we just picked up another coin? A coin of slumber. Must be equipped as other. It increases your defense and luck. Okay, so is that better than her scarf? Ribbon? Whatever. Yeah, it takes uh, her defense up an extra 10 points. So, perfect. It's good to have. Hopefully we get another coin of some sort. Oh my god, what is this? Is this a boss fight? Is this something? Oh, let's touch it. You finally got here. This is the third... Your sanctuary location, but it's mine now. Take it from me, if you dare. Oh, buddy, the trillion age Majingus. Oh, God, we're not in a great place for this, are we? Uh, 
What are we gonna do here? Let's shoot it. And then Pongo can use fire on all of them. And Farku can use hmm, the bomb. No, the bomb's only on one. I thought for sure the bomb would be multiple. Golly gee williker. All right, shoot one of the sprouts so that we can kill him because I don't think the fire is going to be enough to kill it. Yeah, no. Good thing it's, it's seeds are not sprouting. Goodness gracious. No, 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 no. No, there. <laughs> none of that. The thing is trying to heal. You can't be doing that, poopy. Not around me. Pongo, now's your chance to do another big old fire blast. And Farku, you shoot the big one. Because this fire blast should be enough to kill the uh, the little boy. Perfect. All right, now it's just boss time. Dang. Darn near killed Pongo. It did kill Pongo. Even though Pongo's not dead somehow. Can we heal her? We can't heal her. Uh, is there anything we can do for Pongo? Mmm, life noodles. But maybe not yet. Let's just shoot it. <laughs> yep. I could have. I could have healed it then. I could have. Oh well. Whatever. I mean, it's fine. No. 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 Farku. Gosh darn it. Gosh darn it. You can't be doing this right now, buddy. <laughs> Goodness gracious, use the bomb because the bomb doesn't take any, like, consideration. You just kill it. No, oh, well, you're dead, too. Farku threw the bomb at LP. Wow. Wow. All right, let's use goods. We need to use the life noodles on Pongo so that she can help us. And Farku, as your dying act, I'm going to ask you to defend. So Pongo's back. This is great. Uh, paralysis, please don't. Good, okay. Now LP, you need to shoot this. Pongo, you need to do this fire. <laughs> the only fire you can in Farku, you continue to guard because that's all you're good for right now. You will just hurt us if you do anything else. LP again, and Pongo, pray and please be a good prey. Subtle light, eh, a little bit of health. Perfect, perfect. We're going to... We're, uh, Chimachanga diddly dongus. Oh, bash it. Do it before you're dead. You're dead. All right. Oh, man. I like that there's like a speed element, right? Like the, the HP is going down, but you can still like mash the A button and have that party member attack. Oh, boy. I accidentally attacked with Farku, too. Farku's going to... Oh, Farku's not feeling strange anymore. Nope, he is. Oh, buddy, he killed himself. Great, well done. Well done. All right, this is bad news bears. We're about to die here. We're about to die here. We have, what can we do? We can do, uh, we can shoot it. <laughs> oh, and it dodged, isn't it great? Yep, just glare at me, please, so that I can. Oh, no, yes, yes, oh, my God. <laughs> oh, baby, that was intense and look how much experience we got it's a shame that we're not splitting that because man that could have gone a long ways in helping pongo and farku but lp gets to level up and gets hypnosis he gets to level up twice wow very nice very nice he gets to level up thrice even goodness gracious i mean that was a super duper stressful battle so gosh darn should get to level up thrice and then what's beyond this do we get the thing we get the thing, what is this? This is the thing. Very nice. Very, very nice. Elpie thought he heard his mother from far away. She said, be a thoughtful, strong boy. Elpie's soundstone recorded the melody of the Milky Well. Is this milk then? Oh, we're all alive! Oh my god. We did it. You guys didn't get any of that sweet, delicious XP, which surely, yeah, would have leveled you guys up like three or four times each. Whatever. This cool. And what's next? I don't know. A desert, presumably, but how? We'll figure it out next time. So thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you then. <laughs>